What's up everyone, we're back with some chess again and last time even though I lost at 15-10 uh, time format I, I, I won two blitz games so even though I lost I want to, to get back into this game mode because this is what I enjoy most. So let's try to, to get the win again. And uh, I've been studying with uh, Black the opening that I play more closely but uh, I got white this game which um, isn't usually bad, I'm usually better with white, but uh, hopefully I don't uh, keep losing like I have. So far it's going well. And hopefully we'll have a conventional game for once. I'm kind of <laughs> expecting uh, it by now, like uh, what are the chances? This is my third game I think that I played English. In this series at least I, I have played it uh, quite a while before this and uh, you probably can't tell because I keep losing with it mm, he's spinning my knight but I don't think I really care about that he can take it if he wants that way I have this recapture and I have the the big center of course I'll have to reinforce it first with the knight and the queen the queen is reinforcing it already but yeah Okay, he takes. I don't think that's good, but he can do whatever he wants. Eight. Oh, <laughs> eight. <laughs> Nine ball Johnny. Uh, 1200 rated from the US. Has some strange flair that I haven't seen before. Uh, I'll keep playing like normal though. I'll do this, maybe castle and see if this Bomb belongs here or here later. I haven't hung anything yet, which uh, is kind of an achievement for me. Uh, what should I do though? Should I push here and close up the center? Or should I push here and take the big center? I think I want to keep it closed. Or should I castle first? Uh, does it really matter? I don't think it does. I'll just do this first. Simpler and doesn't allow me to blunder anything by mistake with some tactic that I maybe not see. And this pawn is actually very good at uh, constricting this knight from moving forward. He's playing a bit defensively which I enjoy. And for the first time I get the, the position that I have actually practiced. So the idea here would be to, to push forward with the pawns and uh, maybe, if not get a checkmate, at least uh, win a knight or win a, a major piece. Uh, he's backing off. Maybe he's scared of what's coming. So usually... The bishop would come here before I start attacking, but I don't think there's a necessity for that here. I'll just start attacking and see what comes next. Mm. I don't think this blunders anything. I have a very good position, I think. I don't think he played it right. But uh, to be fair, he's less familiar uh, with this than me, so I don't really blame him. <laughs> Not that I'm very familiar, I'll just start improvising right now and hopefully not blunder al along the way. This is going to get fun and uh, I especially like the fact that he's starting to think and uh, wasting his time more than me. That doesn't usually happen. Uh, if I were him what would I do? I would probably do this. Maybe to try to trade with me. Which is kind of strange that uh, in the English you don't usually want to, to trade this pawn, you want to advance it forward. And now what I would do is uh, keep pushing like this. If I push this, then this, then the knight comes here, then I have a strong attack and it's enjoyable. The only scary thing is this open diagonal. Maybe eventually the king will have to come here or here. Uh, I don't think it's necessary for now though. 
kind of don't enjoy this. Should I ignore it? I think I might. I think it's not a bad idea to ignore it. Hmm, should I do this actually, just to prevent any sort of checks? Let me ask myself first what he's intending to do with this move. Now he has two attackers here, but I have two defenders, so it's not all bad. Hmm. I'll just do this just in case. I don't want any weaknesses right now. You know, I think, like, if I were to assess the position, I think I may have, like, a one or two point advantage on him. I don't know how long I'll be able to keep it, but I'm enjoying it for now. Like, I like that I have more space in the center and he's, uh, he has to break through somehow and... Uh, is this the way forward? I, I can't tell you, but maybe it is, who knows? The scary thing for him is that uh, he shouldn't be... Oh, that, that's definitely not a good move for him. But he really shouldn't be opening up the center when I have such a strong bishop. That's not where it's looking, it's a light square bishop, thank you. Uh, what I'll do is I'll, I'll just trade like so. Then the knight can come here, the queen can come here. Okay, very nice. Oh, actually, is it very nice though? I think I may have blundered. <laughs> uh, it had to happen sooner or later, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Then what should I do? Should I... Should I come here? I don't want to give him my bishop like that. And I want to keep supporting the pawn so, somehow, so I think this is a good plan. I have some nice discoveries here, so it's not just a free pawn that I gave him. There's some trickery right here. He can't easily go back, because I'll just... No, not even block him with the pawn actually, I'm just looking at straight up taking him. That will open up his kink even more. And then I can start coming with the knight, with the queen. The queen would come here. Maybe even slide over like this and push the rooks forward. I think it's still very good for me. Uh, What's the intention behind that move? I don't really see it. Okay, knight wants to come here anyway, so I'm just uh, going to do it right now. I even have a tempo on his knight. Maybe he doesn't see it and he blunders. Hopefully he does. Uh, that's attacked. Okay, that's a move that I didn't see actually, so good for him. And it's getting kind of heated. I have to admit, he's even threatening a checkmate right here. <laughs> Did I mess up? <laughs> uh, let's see, let's see. I think I might have messed up. If I take here, then he takes with the queen. Ah... Uh, don't I have anything better? Like anything would, would do. Just not this, please. Uh, I can't even escape because uh, the knight's blocking off this square. I really did mess up, didn't I? Man. Uh, what, what should I do then? I guess I have to take the knight, I don't see any other option. If I block with the bishop, he takes the bishop. And I have the same problem still. None, the knight can defend any anyhow. The bishop... I can't bring it back here to defend because I have my own pieces blocking it. Uh, it's very unfortunate, but I think I have to take. 
Да, he removed that. <laughs> he messed up. <laughs> oh, thank goodness. Uh, that, that was undeserved. I'm not even gonna analyze that. Let's play another game. Another English. 100% win rate this episode. Oh, that wasn't supposed to happen, man. He didn't expect me to accept my losses. I was too humble for him. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Uh, any misplace here? No, I don't think so. This is so good. Is it? Yeah, it is. There's, there's no way he's defending that, that square more than me. Once, twice, three times. I'm defending it once, twice, three times. And, uh, yeah, he's really considering this move, I think. Should I take that? I think it's a good idea to take that. Yeah, I will. He has a full center, but um, it's not all good. Can I do this? No, he can just block like this or like this. Not too good. But I can do this, maybe. Uh, yeah. If I do this and he pushes, what do I do then? I don't like this anymore. <laughs> uh, I don't want to put the queen here. That's kind of uh, defeats the purpose of the opening. Should I play like this? Or should I play like this, maybe? I think I have to play like this. It's better for me. Because, uh, first of all, I'm preventing him from pushing uh, forward, which I don't really like, kicking away my knight like that. And secondly, if he takes, I have the queen here. Ah, uh, is that good? I don't know. I don't know, honestly. I can try uh, undermining that pawn. Maybe that works. And if he pushes it even forward, I just take it. So that doesn't really work for him. <laughs> A very strange position right out of the opening. Who is better here? I, I can't really tell, honestly. I think I might be better because he's trying to overcompensate for his weaknesses. Uh, if I take like so... Like this, this bishop isn't doing anything, my knight isn't gonna be moving. Takes, 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 takes. Oh, I see how the, the bishop is overcompensating. Uh, if I do this check, he has always this response, which I shouldn't be looking at. Or I guess I should be looking at, but shouldn't be doing the move that I want to consider, is what I want to say. I kind of want to play this, but if he pushes, I just take instead and I have moved twice. Not very good for me. Mm. I think I'll pile up on the pressure maybe that way I also get them pinned yeah I think I like this oh no I, I don't get them pinned uh, my king is pinned not my queen but yeah I can enjoy this I think I'll do this he's overextended this must be wrong there's no way this is correct he can defend like this that I can see which is kind of bad, honestly, for me, because um, uh, <laughs> uh, the, the bishop is uh, hitting my queen through the x-ray. Not really good, but I can kick it away at least. Very unconventional. Pepo share from Venezuela. I wouldn't have been able to guess that flag, actually. 
if I didn't read it. I guess you learned something new with chess every day when you see these flags. I used to be really good at knowing flags when I was little, but uh, I have forgotten them since. Maybe I should brush up on that knowledge. Like Bulgaria is kind of easy. But I think for most people, the, the Slavic uh, countries are kind of uh, difficult to, to get right. Because most of the flags are kind of uh, similar to one another. <laughs> I kind of struggle with it myself nowadays too actually, so I shouldn't be pretending like I know everything, but yeah. Mm. Also, uh, what do you think about the chess series? Like, uh, this is supposed to be my fourth episode, but uh, I think there should have been like uh, one week already since the releases of the episodes. And I'm just uh, recording them one after the other, day after day, so I don't really know the how well received they are. Uh, I think I might might have misplayed actually. He's playing against this pawn now, which um, which I should have anticipated maybe. Yeah, if I take here, he takes here and he threatens my queen. Ah, uh, but then I have this move, a check, forcing him to go back with the knight. And then I take again. Okay, it's not all bad actually. I can I can respect this move. Let's see if he falls for it. It's not really a trap, it's just a way for me to get out of trouble. <laughs> Which at this point I might uh, have to do. I think his position is better being better developed and all. I just have this uh, center that uh, is going to fall apart <laughs> shortly. At least I have this bishop that is going to get very strong if I don't trade it off. Uh, what else do I have? I have this bishop ready to be deployed anywhere that I want it. This knight is kind of an issue though. Like I have to get it out of here and castle. But if I do castle, the, the rook is gonna be open, which I really enjoy. Same goes for queenside castling actually, because the rook is going to be here. On another... I was gonna say half open file, but both pawns are here. I don't think they are gonna be here for long though. There are some trades waiting to happen here. Yeah. He, he tried. Tried exactly what I anticipated. Let's see if it works out. Now he has to go back. And I take with this, the pawn here. He takes with the knight. Oh, the, the knight is attacked twice now. But at least I have this defense. I don't have any knight defense, do I? Actually, isn't this hanging? No, not really, because the my knight is pinned, so this isn't really a move right now. Uh, a difficult position, to be sure. If I end up surviving, I think this is going to be beneficial for me. Okay, let's let's go. This can't be wrong, I'm just defending. And my queen isn't being threatened right now. Honestly, I think uh, on this move right uh, here, maybe he should have blocked with the bishop, that's not really something I considered. Actually, no, it is something I considered, because then I would be able to just take the bishop and be a bishop up. Okay, so everything's good, never mind. I like that this is an equal game. <laughs> you can see I'm <laughs> I'm playing equal games with people who are lower rated than me, so you really know that I don't belong here. Uh, should I take with the bishop? 
Yeah, I have to take with the bishop because it's hanging and then the queen will take it. Nice try though, I almost fell for it. And I still have this pressure right here with the with the bishop and the queen. Okay, I take here. We are equal on material, but the attack isn't over yet. Should I trade here? I think it's good because uh, if I trade here it's check. He's most likely going to, to just escape or recapture. Okay, he, he reacted early. That's good for him. Uh, but even still... Isn't this good? Maybe not. Can I pile up pressure? I think I actually can. This is a very good move. Okay, okay, I like this move. Yeah, because he blocked the queen, now I can long castle. Very good for me. His dig isn't a check, is there? He has this check. Does that do anything for him? I don't think so. I can even... I was going to say that I can even block, but the only block is this, which I wouldn't really want to do. There is also this block, I guess, but that's not good. And I think he wants his queen here anyway, just to, to defend. Okay, he disagrees with me. If I come here, if I come here, what's going to happen next? Because I, I don't really want to give up on this pressure right here. There's something happening and I don't want any of the pieces that I have developed to be leaving those squares. So I'll try doing something different. Let's say if the king comes here, how can he check me? Can he even check me? If he checks me like so, I take him. If he checks me like so, I take him. What other check does he have? Does he have a knight check? No. A bishop check? No. Uh, a bishop check actually. No, it's a light square bishop, so he doesn't have anything. This might be the, the best place to put my, my king. Otherwise on the light square he's gonna get attacked like so. And that opens up more possibilities for him, even with the bishop, which is even scarier. So yeah, I like what's going on right now. Is he gonna come back with the queen and admit his mistake? But I don't see a way forward. Uh, he tries. That doesn't really work though because... Oh, it, it does work actually because the knight is defending it. Hmm... What if I... There, there must be something here, like come on. If I take with the rook, he takes with the knight because that's his intention obviously. And then I even have moves like this. But what if I instead play knight here, hoping to come here? Hmm, I think it's worth a shot. He probably thinks that I'm stupid for doing this, but I don't really care. Yeah, as expected. Now I can do this. Hoping to put the rook here and to recharge my missing rook. There is an attack going here. I just know it. I can feel it. And I think it's going to end up uh, perfectly at 30 minutes this video because <laughs> this game isn't going to last much longer, I don't think. Like if he defends properly then he wins, I lose. But if I manage to get some checkmate or at least a material advantage, then it's good for me. He tried defending like so. Uh, if I come with the rook here. Hmm. 
don't I have a better move? Coming here. I'll try this. That probably allows him to defend like so, but it, I at least can get a pawn like that. Even another pawn. What if I try to distract his queen like this? A check. Check. And he attacks nothing else. If I come here, can he attack me in any way? I don't think uh, he can. Uh, I think he is in trouble now. He may be in trouble. I'll just hide away. I don't think I can be punished for this. But I like his spirit. He's attacking me in the in the middle of defending his own position. That's how a winning mindset should be. I don't really have that myself, so if I do this with the knight, that must be correct. Let me count. I'll have one, two, three attackers. He'll have one, two, and with the queen three defenders, but then uh, even the bishop can come over. Okay, I think uh, I'll win this. I'll win this uh, if I keep piling on pressure. Uh, yeah, right? No funny business here. Okay, this is good. I think this bishop is the hidden hero of this situation because I don't think he's calculating for it. Nobody ever expects the, the fianche to bishop to, to come through, but it always does. That's just how well developed it is. And we'll see, he, he's thinking for himself. If I were him, what would I do? He has no checks. I made sure that the, that uh, he doesn't have any checks. So best he can do is probably something like this or this. Defend with the queen. Yeah, as expected. Uh, but then... If I take once again, he puts the, the rook. He has to put the rook there and I put my bishop and then I think he has no option. Yeah, he can't even take because it's pinned by the queen. Okay. That was a close call actually. I think if I mess up the order, like if I put the bishop in first, he can just take my knight. And then we're equal. Right. Uh, but I'll try this actually. He can't come with the queen here because I'll just take with the rook and be up material. Yeah, now I have this move. That doesn't work anymore. I think now he has to give up on the piece. Oh, but now he has this move. I didn't consider that. Ah, that's scary. Yeah, yeah, he, he saw it, he saw it, but it's alright, since uh, I can just run away, I don't really want to move any of my pieces and the queen itself can do anything much. Yeah, the rook can't move, it's just uh, my king against his queen, which... Uh, I hopefully don't screw up. I'm being a little bit brave here, but <laughs> I think I have to be if I want to make a comeback. Maybe he, he should just be happy with the pawn. He probably has more checks. Or does he actually? He can't come here or here. He wouldn't even want to go there. Here I mean. 
Uh, here he can't come, here he can't come, here also. Does he have more checks? Here he cannot, here he cannot. I think that might be all the checks that he has. So I think I'm good, finally. I'll be up just uh, slightly in material though, so it's not like it's game over, I'll just uh, have to, to try hard in the end game as well. Come on man, what are you thinking about? It's all over. Just accept defeat man. He doesn't want to, as expected. I didn't really expect uh, any such attack myself, so... I think I'm proud of this, or am I? It's kind of like... Uh, like I calculated some of it, but not the entirety of it. You, you could see that uh, he played some moves that I didn't really expect, so... Uh, yeah, I think it's, it's a mixture of skill and luck that got me in this position. Let's see what he does though. Ah, he finally gives up on it. What should I take with though? Ah, uh, should I... If I take like so... Maybe he's looking at some, some weird check he can give me. Uh, I think I like this most. I maybe should have told on his time instead of talking so much. If I do this, he has this move though, which is it really scary? I don't think it is because I can just come back and defend like so. Or even with the queen, forced queen trade. I'll, I'll try taking with rook. I like the queen being here because it's kind of defensive. Defend some key squares that uh, he might want to attack. Even though a long queen isn't going to do much. Uh, now I can come back with the queen. Does he feel pressured into trading with me? I hope he does. But I think he's going to play this because he knows that. Otherwise, oh... Maybe not. If I come here, what move could he do to check me? This, but then I take him. This, this would be a good move for him. Ah, uh, what else, what else? Ah, uh, he, he's trying some shenanigans, but I don't think it's going to work. He's trying to set up for some fork of my of my king and my rook because they are the only two undefended pieces. Uh, let me think, if I do this, can he win my rook somehow? That's what's most worrying usually. Or even my bishop, but I don't think he can get my bishop. Uh, this would be a square or this. That can defend that uh, that can attack both. Excuse me, or this. But that wouldn't work if I come back like so. He's going to run me out of time at this rate. Yeah, he's trying. He's trying once again. I don't really want to pin myself. But I think it may be required. Or he wants to win the pawn maybe. I'm not giving him a chance to, to win. I don't really want that. Actually now that I look at it I was worried over nothing because this rock is defended by the bishop. Maybe he wants a draw against me, but uh, I won't really allow that. I'm not giving him my, my pawns either. And yeah, I guess it's only a matter of defense at this point. He's definitely losing. 
like uh, a queen alone, I know I'm saying this over and over, but a queen alone can do enough damage like this. Uh, if I come behind the queen, he can't really attack me in a way that he might want. And then if he does this move, I can just block with my rook, so it's all good. I just want to have my pieces coordinated. It's kind of bad that uh, my bishop isn't really playing, but uh, yeah, I expected that he'd do that. Uh, now he's a little bit screwed though. Because he can't give me any check now. He's locked. He's locked away. He's, this might even be his only move right now. Yeah. As expected. Uh, what should I do now though? Ah. Uh, Should I bring back my bishop, just so that <laughs> it's defended as well? I don't know. Ah, he's also targeting this pawn though, so it's not all good. Mm. What I should... I should maybe try dominating uh, uh, his queen with my queen in a way just so that he doesn't check me in any way or I could try defending that pawn that I am hanging even though isn't this a good defense a good defense is a great offense as they say Oh, actually, it's not a, it's not as good as I thought because uh, he can take it and defend at the same time. Why am I struggling so much? He's just good as all. Yeah. At least he's kind of in jail again. If I try to do this, I don't want to, oh, I'm going to be hanging another pawn that way. Uh, what should I do then? Oh, not really actually, because if he takes that, then I can check him. I'll try getting in a queen trade, if he allows it. He might be greedy and go for this pawn. But then I get this pawn in exchange, so it's not all bad. Yeah. As I expected. Okay. And now I can start doing some damage. If I do this, there's no way that I... I think this is good. Oh wait, should I actually do this? If I do this, then he has to take. L let me calculate this, I think I have the time. If I do this, then he has to take. Because if he doesn't take, I'm just going to checkmate him. And uh, otherwise, I guess the defense would be to to come with the queen here or here to defend. Mm, it's not that good actually. Yeah, he has some defenses there. Okay, I'll just come back. Come back like so. And then I can start thinking about doing moves like so. <gasps> oh no, I blundered! I blundered this move! Oh no! 
yeah awful 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 and then he can even come this way if he wants to to check me again I have to hide away in this corner I guess good thing nothing is hanging Uh, he's running me so low on time, I guess he's an endgame uh, enthusiast unlike me. I try to win by the end of the mid game, even though you probably can't tell by my horrible play, but anyway. He's going to look for a check, there's no other way. But then I hide here and he has no other checks. And everything defends everything. Except for the queen, but the queen can defend herself, so I shouldn't worry about her. Mm, I still should be winning, even still that I dropped uh, two points of material. I didn't need those pawns anyway. I just need checkmate. Now he's the one thinking which I enjoy. Although, other than check, I don't believe he has any good move. Uh, am I mistaken? Can he do something like... No, this is my idea. I want to do this and this. Uh, he's freeing up his... Uh, his king. Let me take a look. If I do this, he comes here, then I do this, he can either come back, uh, if he comes back, I don't think that's good, so uh, he won't come back, let's assume he goes here, then what do I have, then I have this, no, this, this would be attacked by the queen, so I have to find something else. What if I instead of the rook I slide the, the queen over there? I think that might be better. Let's see. I'm finally the one attacking as I should be. But I think he, he, he may escape, I'm not sure. Uh, I definitely have a win here. I need to find it. Okay, he has only one move. He's going to move here, then what do I do? And do I go with the, with the bishop or the queen? I think bishop might be better. I don't know, I don't know. Okay, uh, king here. I should think on his time really because I have no time left. If I go queen here, he has to escape this, that's his only move. And then I go here, he has to come here. Then what happens next? Uh, okay, let, let me consider that again. He's here, my queen is here. Uh, then I have this move again. Yeah, I, I think that works out. Because then my rook will start uh, playing. Yeah, and I have this. Then I have this. If I keep checking him, I'll win some time back, so I don't really sweat uh, the time issue now. Finally, I'm the one attacking, because he let up for a single second. Oh, that's a move that I didn't expect. Do I have another check? Mm. I should really think about this. <laughs> uh, I don't have a check with the queen. 
I have this check with the Conley. Maybe I should do that. Hmm, I don't know. I really don't know. I may have messed up. I hope I didn't. I'll just slide back here. So that everything defends everything once again. And the king being there is uh, very dis disruptive to him. Oh, actually, you know what? I think I should have done this. That's that's definitely my next move if he if he does nothing. Because then I would be pinning the queen to his king and uh, the rook is defended. I think he's starting to get tired as well. Oh, this episode is it's so long. <laughs> uh, it's fine, it's fine. A check. Okay. Fine. A check it is. Should I come here then? Should I defend? Should I block? If I come here, then he will come here. Oh, he can't come there because the, the queen is defending. Okay, then it's all good. Uh, this is so stressful. Come on, man. Just resign already. <laughs> you know I beat you. It feels kind of strange that I keep dropping in time, but I guess I keep thinking a lot about my move, so it makes sense. I mean that uh, there is a 10 second increment each time. Okay, that may be a little bit too aggressive, my friend. Let's see now. Double check. He's going to come here most likely. And I'll start chasing him away. Oh, not like that. That would, that would blunder. Uh, I don't know. I really don't know. Oh, that, that's a misplay. How do I do that? Okay. How do I undo that? If he finally starts caving a little. Now he wants to trade with me. Even though... Don't I have some move? Oh, isn't this insanely strong? I think I won finally. Yes, sweet. Because if he takes it, yeah, this is check and I can pick up his rook. Okay, okay, finally, finally. The second he decided that he wants to trade queens with me, he lost. He ran out of brain juice first. Nice. Can you resign now? <laughs> can you resign, please? Yep, as expected. Hmm, what should I do? I should cut the king off like this. Yeah, he won. Uh, he lost, I mean. Okay, that's a game worth checking out. I don't care about the time. Only two mistakes and two blunders for such a long game. Let me review it. It's going to be a 50 minute video, but uh, who cares? And I'm over at 1200 rating again, by the way. Very close accuracy, but I have three great moves. Let's see what happened here. Okay, okay, everything's book. And I deviated first, what's the best move? The knight. Uh, I had that last episode as well, having the knight there be the, the, the best move. Really? That's what, what should I have done? Pinning the knight in response? I guess so. 
even though it's kind of um, okay okay a mistake I didn't really want the pressure though so I didn't feel too bad the castling here is a mistake I was so proud of that move what should I have done again just slide the queen back I really thought that I had a, a good play going wait uh, what, what should I have done here go in the other direction mm, are there checks that way I guess not wait there's this check though can I block it somehow I, I'm really too lazy to calculate this I'll just uh, watch over everything okay finally yeah the, my two great moves back to back forced taking with the rook wasn't best was taking with the queen best with the bishop I would have to never thought of that move check defend check defend check defend yeah he's just relentless here uh, I wanted to, to trade queens with him in a sneaky way but uh, he saw that he takes yeah it's kind of a an equal game what should I have done bishop there oh no I was too scared to do that because it would be check city then ah now it's a it's an equal game probably a perpetual check in a way oh bishop moving back here is a brilliant move or a great move at least I was just like I'm scared please defend me ah uh, what? what why is that a blunder what should I have done or oh, rook there, rook there instead. I was calculating both lines, but but uh, queen seemed better for some reason. And that's a mistake. I was so proud, though. Yeah, and and he just resigned here after I cut him off. Okay, this is going to be it for this video. I'm tired, and probably you are as well. Thank you for watching. Like, sub, do all the generic stuff, and uh, I'll see you next time. Take care.